Oh my lord, I do not remember going to bed last night. I just simply don't. And you? You simply don't help at all. You've been sat outside my door whining like a little dog for like 20 minutes. Shut your mouth, right? Shut your bloody mouth. <laughs> Tom's stroking that pussy in the bed. He's stroking that pussy in the bed. <sighs> Alright, see you later. Going to America. Bye. Everyone's still in my house from the party that I had last night, but I need to go now, so uh, yeah, I'm going to get in my taxi. Here we go. Door one, terminal two, drop off. And you better know, I got Ron's watch. Didn't forget it this time. All right, I have a ticket going in the country. I have a ticket going out the country. There's no reason they shouldn't let me in, but we'll see how things go. Last time this didn't go so well. Oh yeah, the staff there were absolutely awesome. I've got my Esther, I can get in the country. I've got my ticket and I've upgraded to business class. <laughs> Made it through security super fast. I'm now gonna try and find the business lounge and get this vlog edited. By invitation only. All right, San Francisco. Um, I think it's that one, 11.20, waiting lounge, okay. I am panicking like a mother trucker right now. I've not edited my vlog, I've not uploaded it, and this flight's 12 hours, basically. So if I don't get it done and uploaded now, I'm gonna miss a day of uploading. Looking for Joe's book, 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 Joe's book. Where is it? I wanna put it in first place. I don't see it, 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 I don't see it. Joe, is that it? I'm probably staring at it right now and I just can't see it. Joe, if you're watching this, I tried. Virgin holiday room. Nope, wasn't in that one. I'm in a place called the Escape Lounge. Mm. Mate, this is a nice ass lounge. I'm gonna get a drink and continue my edit. I've got about 45 minutes to get it done. Oh my God, this is gonna be the first day I'm gonna miss an upload of the vlog. It's now five minutes to 11. My flight's boarding. I edited my video, went to upload it and found out the video was corrupted. I get on, my, I get on the plane in less than 10 minutes, and I'm on the plane for 11 hours and 40, 40 minutes. It's, you know, my first day without an upload. Oh my god. Be right back. You can't make this up. I chilled out in the lounge, editing my vlog together, thought it was ready to go, and it corrupted. I was like, oh my god. So I had to take loads of clips out of the vlog and take out probably like a 10 minute portion out of yesterday's vlog just so I could upload it on time and made it a 720p video, not a 1080p, just so I could upload it. But thank goodness, the upload speed was so fast on my phone that I put it up there as we were setting off on the actual runway. So thank God, I think yesterday's vlog uploaded, if it did, let me introduce you to my home for the next uh, 11 and a half hours. That's basically what I'm sat in. We get a little foot rest, we get a little menu, a table, and a free leather bag. Nice. I like it. Been given a wet towel with yellow stains on it. Hang on a minute, what bloody hell's going on over there? Can I actually make this a private little booth? Because if I can't, I am definitely doing that. I'm really confused. I know what it is. You can't get it yourself personally, but they put it there for the crew because this is a 10 hour flight. It goes along and it's a custom part of the plane for them to attach like all the curtains to. So the crew can get some sleep and like a break sort of thing. Never seen it on a plane before. Quite impressed. Hello you. Seems a bit uh, direct, but let's take a look. Starters, Parma Hamlet asparagus. Yes, please. Four mains, fillet of beef in berenet sauce, wasabi roasted salmon, wild mushroom risotto, hot tomato and mozzarella salad. I'm actually liking the sound of the risotto. For pudding, we have molten chocolate sponge pudding and eaten mess. I'm looking at the, 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 the sponge pudding there, that sounds pretty damn good. And then what else we got in here, what else we got? At the bar, okay, we've got a selection of drinks, cheese and port, and some extra bites. Gourmet pork pulled burger, Paella with chicken and prawns. What? That's a bite? That sounds like a meal. And then enjoy a selection of free sandwiches. Nice. Awesome. Look at this. You've got this little armrest here. You've got a table that pops out. You've got a, I think, a drink tool over there. That's pretty dope. You've got the screen that goes in here. It's massive. But here is my USB. I don't really care about that. Uh, not too sure about that. Uh, not too sure about that. 
Uh, what else? Blade Runner. I've never actually seen that. I'm going to watch that. Because I know they're bringing out that new Blade Runner, so I'm going to watch that so I understand the new one. I haven't seen this either. I really want to watch it. So I've got two films at least that I can watch and then sleep for the rest of the flight. Nine hours, 38 minutes to go. I actually thought it was 11 and a half hours, but guess not. Here we go. Let's do Blade Runner. And I got a little snack. They brought me some crisps. Or to Americans, chips. Here we go. We've got a nice little drinks car over here. My table. Look at my little salt and pepper. Oh, thank you very much. This film is so weird. So damn weird. However, I've got my starter. Look at that. Parmaham. No way. I just love, love Parmaham. Alright. Now we're talking. I got a mushroom risotto. Mushroom risotto. I could have gone for a beef or a steak or whatever it was, but instead I decided to go for uh, something a little bit different. Let's give it a go. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Pretty good. Cheers. I so much prefer flying with Virgin. It's absolutely incredible. I cannot believe how good this what the service is. The chairs are, the screens, selection of movies. Just look at this place. Absolutely brilliant. I, I love it. A nice coffee with a little chocolate cake. Hmm. Wait, is it hot? It's hot. Oh, it's beautiful. This film is so creepy. <laughs> Either way, a nice selection of cheeses to go alongside my coffee. I was offered a glass of port, but I don't know what port is, and I don't think I want it. I was watching Blade Runner, and it was beautiful. Beautiful film, but bloody hell, the story drags, and it's very weird storytelling. Welcome to the bathroom. You have soap, hand sanitizer, and fresh and clean three-in-one surface cleaner. It's time to find out what the heck is in this bag. So first of all, toothpaste. Well, actually, we've then got a little sachet bag with... Uh, wait, how do I get it? I want to get in it. I thought I broke it. I think it's got like soap and stuff in it. Oh, wait. Hand cream. Lip balm. Peppermint. And face cream. Next up we have the obvious pair of socks. I'm going to put them on now. A sleep mask, which is actually really comfy. A pen. Toothbrush. Airpods. And that's everything. Look at it. That is well nice. That is so damn nice. Nice. Oh wow, uh, I can tell you. Truly, truly exhausted. I got my little bed. I'm so tired. So, so tired. These time zones are just messing me up. Dubai was three hours ahead of England. And then I had one day in England, and now I'm going eight hours behind in LA. I just, I just want to go to bed. But the problem is, if I sleep on this plane now when I land, it'll be like nine o'clock at night, so that I won't be able to sleep, and it'll mess my next day up. Potato mode engaged. Me, there's a bar behind here, like where everyone can sit around and drink, and it is popping. I'm not going to join it because I'm watching a, movie, a film called Gold, and it's really damn good. And. Uh, yeah, if I tried to sleep through this noise, I just could not. Film absolutely pants. I just, I just watched it and it was so, so bad to the point where I <laughs> voted it a no to recommend and closed it halfway through. I'm watching Hacksaw Ridge. It's absolutely incredible, this film. I'm not gonna lie. I did skip the first 30 minutes of it just because I wanted to get straight into the action. Um, and I'm very happy I did. I probably will at the end go rewatch the beginning, but I love war films. I, I, I can't, I, don't, I didn't pick up whether this is a true story or not, because if it is, oh my lord. Um, but I've just got my food. So this is a little bit of paella that I got, or paella that I got, so I'm pretty excited to try this. Yeah. 
don't know, man. I'm like genuinely sad. I just watched the film um, Hacksaw Ridge. It's like a true story. Holy shit. You should really watch that film. Really. Alright. Oh, Let's try and see where they're Oh, I can't see anything. Where the hell are we? Oh, we're just up in the clouds. And this is the bar that all these guys have been stood at earlier. Like, I think there's one guy drinking here for like six hours straight. That guy must be past the hell out right now. How cool is that? Three chairs here for like a, a bar service that they've got. And I'm sat right there, so I can hear all the noise. So it turns out that that bar that I was stood at, I was like, there's someone been drinking there for like six hours straight. The staff had to cut him off because he was drinking that much, to the point where they're like, we can't serve you alcohol, but if you've got your own alcohol on the plane, then you're allowed to drink that. So what he was doing was picking up other people's drinks and drinking them. And I thought he was annoying from sat down so I just spoke to all the staff and they were like we cut him off we were trying to get rid of him um, so <laughs> they put on the um, sit down sign to get rid of him not the seatbelt sign they put on the seatbelt sign to get rid of him and make him sit down so he sat down they kept it on and let him fell asleep time to take care of business and brush my teeth I've got about two more hours to go so brush my teeth have a drink of water. Watch another film. Choppers are clean. Time to go and relax and pray that that guy is not back at that bar. Oh, uh, I had an itchy leg, so I thought I'd just give it a quick scratch. And I'm peeling from sunburn. So bad. What the actual heck? Are you serious? Are you actually serious? Look how dusty my skin is. I forgot to put my phone on uh, airplane mode and when I flew over Greenland from England to the US it connected to their mobile data and charged me £18. There we go, I've made it, time to get off this plane and uh, next destination LA so I've got to rush to it because I've got about an hour before it departs. Whoa, and that right there is why I do not check bags. I squeeze everything into my backpack and the carry on because I never want to have to get back from this place. I do a team to catch my connecting flight to Los Angeles. Los Angeles, Virgin, gate 44. That's a police officer on a pedal bike in an airport. <laughs> it beats walking. I have been walking for ages. Aha, uh -huh. this is looking good. Gates 40 to 59, I'm gate 44, and security checkpoint, so I think I'm gonna get some liquids taken off me. Gate 44, Los Angeles, that's my flight. And we're still not boarded. Man, I just really forgot how hot it is in America. I'm absolutely sweating my tits off. I feel like it's warmer <laughs> here than it is in Dubai, which is obviously false, but bloody hell, it is warm in San Francisco. I wish I was wearing my flippy floppies and my shorts. <sighs> I like how I just went to get on the plane, scanned my boarding ticket to walk on, and it popped up saying, not on flight. I looked straight at the dude and he was like, you're good, and just <laughs> let me walk on. This is going to be awkward if someone's sat in my seat. My bag doesn't fit in, in the locker above. I'm screwed. I really don't want to check my bag. I'll probably lose it. Whew. And I made it to Los Angeles. Hey, if it's here, you see all people getting on it, we might as well take it, right? This is how we do it. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> you nearly ran me over, so I was like, hey, you can give me a lift now. <laughs> So easy. It literally drove me like three feet, but I love it. Oh, man, it is busy at the airport. It's Sunday and everybody's coming home. 20, 30 minutes and I'll be home relaxing. Just got back to my apartment in LA and oh my gosh, someone who lives in my apartment has got an amazing Jeep Wrangler. Fully naked Wrangler and they've got a custom light bar on the top. Nice. And oh shit, I have left my AC on. Yep, on permanently on for... A month straight. That's gonna cost me a lot of money. Anyway, my plan of action is simple. Grab my jacket, grab my black Chelsea boots. There we go. Gonna need to grab myself mm, two shirts from here. So have I got all Saint, two All Saint shirts? Perfect. Uh, I've showered and now I think it's time to head downtown and meet up. 
Okay, nearly ripped the fucking curtain off. <laughs> and meet up with the boys. Lack of sleep is catching up with me so bad right now, but uh, gonna go check into my hotel room, drop off the stuff, and meet the team. This elevator is something else. Fashion. Okie dokie, let's not get comfortable. Let's check out this room. This is what we're dealing with. All right, this is the, called the Line Hotel. Nice big bed in the middle of the room. I was, because the bed's like that open and that big, I was half expecting a mirror on the ceiling. Trust me, that sometimes happens. Interesting style. Um, I want to say they went for the whole, oh, let's make it look cool by having like no paint on the walls and everything, but in my eyes, that just looks like you ran out of money. And then this sculpture over here. Interesting. I feel like if I was drunk and came into the room and fell onto that, I'd probably pack and die, but I actually kind of like it. Convenient little button on the wall there to lift up the curtains. All right, let's get them cracked. Let's have a look at my view. I think we're staring at some AC units. Some AC units. Oh, okay, you know what? I'm not just staring at nothing. I've got like nice little sunset in the distance, some buildings, and uh, whoever works in that office is definitely seeing my book crack in the morning. Very interesting style in this hotel. Like modern, hipster, I mean, well, modern, construction, hipster, grandma's house, no idea. Check the bathroom out. Ooh, what we got? Okay, uh, okay. Um, oh, some, what the, what? I don't understand that. Okay, so, so someone brought the grandma's curtains in here. Someone brought my an, auntie's mirror. But other than that, the layout is actually kind of nice. Straight, what, a, what a weird style hotel. LA is always weird. You better know the most important pair of shoes that I brought ain't those. They ain't those. They're these. <laughs> Of course I had to bring them. Well, they were already in my suitcase, to be honest, so I just brought them. I don't know what went wrong with me this trip. I'm wearing a pair of Chelsea boots right now. I then bought my brown Chelsea boots with me from the UK, flip-flops and Jordans. I've never, ever taken so many shoes on a trip. I, I don't even know what it's the lights. I, this hotel continues to confuse me. So, um, I'm gonna go. Uh, what? A potato sack to hold blankets. Alright, anyway, and look how drunk that lamp is. Go home lamp, you're drunk. Even the corridor's weird. Look at it, it's like you could say, oh it's fashionable because it looks cool. I know when the carpet looks like it fell out of my grandma's attic and uh, the walls look like you just ran out of money. I'm being a proper reviewer here, like usually I'm like, oh you know, contemporary or something like that. Not this time, no. Boy. Hello! Oh, <laughs> well, first of all, I now. love Dom. No. Dom's always been no. in the box. And second of all, Milo, how are you doing, brother? I literally didn't even realise you'd, you'd got here. Hi, guys. <laughs> Mr. Ruffle Waffles here. I like how I get here with my pubes glued to my face. Most magnificent beard ever. What is that? <laughs> got the fucking peach scrub right here. <laughs> it's good to be joined with you again. He came over to me and went, hey, nice to meet you. I was like, all right, yeah. We've, met. We've met. I don't recall when we last met because we were so drunk. But we did because it's on my Instagram, so. Is it actually though? I'll show you. I don't think I'm quite ready for tonight because you are all so damn drunk already and I'm sober as a goat. I don't, I don't know, goats are sober. This is definitely it. You guys ready for Korean barbecue? Yes. Yeah. Have you had it before? Nah, never. Wait, never. actually no, I had it in Germany. Oh, Korean oh, barbecue that's in Germany. That's as good, yeah, I could even in the bun off. Uh, sleep deprivation update. <laughs> Quarter to nine. Long line. I'm dying. I forgot how annoying E3 is because you turn up with a group of people like eight of us to go out for uh, food and drinks and you can just never get a table. Can you just stop being so fucking tall? Save and me then... from this nightmare I've become right now. I've become so <laughs> no, I, I, can't be. no, no. I don't know the words. <laughs> right. That's all you're getting out of me. You just mumble. <laughs> We've been walking around for ages looking for somewhere to eat and we literally found a place called Korean Barbecue. So I walk here to the door and I'm leaning, leaning on the edge and I say to these girls, I'm like, is it any good? And they're like, yeah, it's really good. So we come in, lo and behold, out of anywhere we could have gone, them two girls. Oh, oh. I like how they obviously did that. Uh, but, oh, oh, she's doing it as well. Oh. Alright, I'm leaving now. I'm not eating here. Bye. Oh, wait, no, I've got an hour and a half. Wait, otherwise. But they watch zombie videos, so they know all of us lot. Crazy, yeah, you're in the vlog. So, Dom, this is technically the place that I first walked past and said that we should go to. Yeah. We ended up returning to it. Yeah. I ended up ordering the food and the drinks. Yeah. But you're going to be the chef. Trust this man. Don't trust this man. <laughs> As for what these lot are going to do, not a fucking clue. What? I got you. Barbecue is the same thing. 
Well, yeah, but just Korean style. Dom, high five, I believe in you. I love you. We're so fine. We're so fine. It's all on you, so like, if it goes wrong, it's your fault. So, so yeah, if, if we all get food poisoning, we blame Activision? Yeah? We can sue them too. We can sue them too? <laughs> Damn! E3, 2017, this is the Squatter Squad. Oh yeah, you're missing out because you're eating leaves or something like that, whatever. <laughs> but nonetheless, to a successful hangover five day streak, yeah? yeah good. Cheers. Cheers, boys. Travel and access provided by Activision. Yeah, and food poisoning for Activision.com. Cheers. Damn! You guys, Ooh, find, you guys find any Easter eggs in the, in the food? Here, here, here. You found the Samantha dolls? Dude, yeah? we're just spinning around oh, right in there. Show me large intestine on your menu. Oh my Come on, God. Dave. What's on your mic? Where? Oh, no. I am so full that Noah's literally reaching over and eating off my plate. Dude, the Texas spice is next level. The Texas you good gotta stuff, be ready. The Texas ready. good stuff, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that good stuff. Oh, yeah. I don't know why it turned into smoking. I was like, <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, that's a good, good, good. It's never spicy. <laughs> there, there was spicy memes, bruh. What's good? What's good? The chicken. Chicken's good? So Wait, good. who cooked it? Did you cook it or? It was me. I was a chef. Did you cut it open? Did you cut it open and check? Chef, chef Alan. If we all die food poisoning, it's my fault. Good stuff. Uh, We're all gonna die. I think it's your friend doesn't believe you. We're all gonna no. die. Don't do it. Don't uh, do it, man. Sorry, Milo. Where have you been? Um, on the streets of LA, my guy. The hard <laughs> streets of LA. It's been it's been a long time. Milo. I'm here. Yay. I made it. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, alive, Mom. Probably. Thank you. Happy birthday to Dom. Happy birthday to Dom. Happy birthday to Dom. Happy birthday to you. And there's your birthday present off the staff. And you just see Valhalla in front of you, and you're just like, I've arrived, guys. Like, oh my goodness, that was a moment for me. I was, holy moly. It was, it was a good moment, dude. It was a good moment. How long has that been going on for? 26 seconds. Is it good? You yeah, like that? Okay, so this is me trying to take a cool Instagram photo. Yeah, it looks alright. Introducing the Cassell beer with beer on it. I love it. I almost feel like Milo is like the Tom McCallum of the group. You don't know, you don't know who Tom McCallum is, but he's a legend. So it's a it's a it's a spicy meme, bro. It's a spicy meatball. No, wait, I said meme. Oh, oh fucking meme. Oh. Hold the fucking phone, yo, we need it, we need a, <laughs> Jesus, we need a cheers. I was like, hey Milo, would you like a drink? And Milo was like, I'll take the whole fucking bottle. <laughs> Dom, we need you in again, come on boys. So, now we can do another cheers, now that we've got Milo joined with us finally. Cheers Milo. After finished finish getting lost walking around Los Angeles. To good health, to happiness, to killing zombies, and to E3 2017. You have to pick a number between one and three. You four, you're the last four remaining. We already played this, all right? I'm gonna pick a number one to three with fingers right. under the table, and I'm gonna go like here this. Here you go, and here then, you go. Yeah, yeah. if you pick it, you're out. So you you don't you don't have to pay. All right, you ready? Oh, I like I like your style. Right, Noah, you're the adjudicator, so you get to decide. Yeah, yeah. Right. I'm already okay. out, so we're good. So, how how many fingers? Put them up in the air. If you chose. Three, you say. What? <laughs> you say, oh, it comes down. <laughs> All right. Here we go, boys. So oh, this is now become, going to become a 50-50. Yeah. Right, so we're going to go down <coughs> to either one or two. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, you ready? Fine. So, who's going for which? <laughs> of course he's going for the one. Well, guess what? He fucked himself because it's two. Yeah! <laughs> And your and your total bill is four hundred and sixty-eight dollars. <laughs> I just got cut. You don't know the words. I'm such a great ammo of war right now. Hey, I'd just like to say this right now, so um, Noah's just uh, eating food and making videos back there. 
So what I'm going to do is use his phone and take photos. So you might be like, take photos, watch. I'm just going to keep pressing the button again and again and again and again until his phone is filled with photos of me. Oh, man. Hey, whose phone is this? That's mine. <laughs> this is your phone. It's still taking photos, dude. Let's go. Take that. Wait, wait, watch, 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 watch. Okay. And I go to watch, go uh, to his photo okay. library and watch. Wait, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? All photos. <laughs> Dude, it doesn't stop. <laughs> and some of these are burst photos too. Oh my god. <laughs> I'd love to know how many I actually took. But so weird you were gonna keep scrolling and then nudes would pop up. I was like, oh my god, no. I can't believe! Really quick before people be like, oh Tom, them glasses you put up like on top of each other fell over. No, 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 no. They got moved and then Noah tried doing it and knocked them all over and I just happened to catch it on camera. So don't think that was my fault. That was all Noah. Super successful Yo, find. Bar Korean barbecue. Oh, wait, oh. Out. Korean barbecue out of 10. 7.9. Okay. <laughs> out of 10. Why? Dank out of 10. No. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, yeah. And you can't yeah. dab out of 10. So out of 10. I don't think it's 3.5. It was a 3.5? Yeah. 3. It is, mate. Out of 10, the restaurant. 1.15? 1.15. 1.15, that's harsh. Out of 10. I'll give it an 8, my friend. 8? Yeah, it was nice. It was tasty. 7.3. Should we all judge in the morning after the food poisoning? Yeah! I'm going to go for a 5.11. 115 backwards. Oh, yeah, reverse your shit. That? that is an Easter egg. Wait. Milo, quick, do Morse code. Morse code? Okay, wait. 1001110011011011. That's not Morse. Yeah. My guy. What are you saying? That's binary. That's Morse. No, no, I'm confused. Yeah, I thought it was. He's been No, what's the computer talk? He's just been. The computer talk? Yeah, 1010011011. That's not Morse. What is it? What is it when a computer talks like that? Binary. Binary? Yeah. Oh, no! Talek was right! I was right all along. There you go. Who's the better Easter egg solver? Milo? Whoa. Dalek? Whoa. Or Noah? It's definitely not me. Cut me out of that equation. And it's not me, so that's why I didn't even say my name. <laughs> Mate, they're all like, hey, do you want to do the, the Easter eggs for charity? I'm like, do you want to fucking lose? Like, <laughs> I'll be on the tip. We'll raise the most money, but... We'll lose the fastest, so let's fucking go. There's no way. So our hotel was saying that he's down there, but I just realised where I am right now. Dad, if you're watching this, Do you want a I've already had one. I was here last time. <laughs> Dad, one look, that's wall, that's my last name. Cause spelled correctly. Oh my god, it is. Cassells. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm so No, no. What? 115? 115? He's so behind, dude. That was <laughs> you were the one who told us about it. Why are you acting? <laughs> More like 935, am I right? <laughs> get out. <laughs> get out. Leave. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Behind the scenes of when I'm being filmed. So I'm checking you out. You're pulling a ridiculous weight. What? <laughs> wow, the savagery. I just walked into a bathroom, went to go to the toilet. Jesus. Oh, Dom. All right, it was a joke the first time for Dom's birthday. And by the way, we paid for the beers at the last place, but we jokingly just sang happy birthday to your boy. Happy birthday to you. My Byron, happy birthday, my friend. What is it? Hotel National, but Tiki style. Okay. <laughs> nah. Nah, fam. I'm done for the night, boys. Yeah. Go on in. Go on in. Go on. Get a nip. Oh, bit of nip. That's a hairy belly, but a bit of nip. <laughs> Wait, what? Real quick, buddy. Thank you so much for all the birthday shit, man. Because that was fucking great of you. And seriously, you didn't need to do that. <laughs> this is the moment that is going to go down forever. Come here. As the moment. Okay, come here. What the come moment? Here. What moment? This is the moment that's gonna be remembered as the Zombies Trilogy. Forever. The Zombies Trilogy? Trilogy. That means we have to make a first film, a second film, and a third film. I'm down. <laughs> this Wait, is the first film. This is episode it's not one. Games? But we're here for five days together, so how do we do a fiveology? A fiveology? A pentology? <gasps> we should just call it five. 
Oh, in the quotation the marks. All the caps. Are you the Pentagon feed? Oh, it's Harvey Yina, my guy. <laughs> the whole time. <laughs> There we have it, a new dawn, a new day, I'm fresh, I'm actually not too, uh, well I am actually tired, but I'm not hungover or anything, which I thought I might be, so uh, thank god for that. But it is the next day ladies and gentlemen, so I've got to get up, get a shower, start my day, and hang out with the team again, because I'm going to be with them for the next five days, so this should be a fun E3, I'm looking forward to seeing anyone, every, anyone, anyone, everyone. But let's get this day started, so I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog, make sure you leave a like, crane really helps out, subscribe, share it with your friends, let them know if they want to like, watch the life of Tom, they can do by just searching life of Tom. Yeah, that's Pretty simple as that, to be honest. And uh, maybe this hotel room will grow on me. It's definitely probably like the comfiest bed I've maybe stayed in all year. So if I did have to give the hotel room a rating out of 10, the for like the aesthetics of it would probably be about a five, but for the comfort of the bed, it would probably be a 10. So 6.2 maybe overall. I need to go because it's now currently 9.20 in the morning and I need to upload this vlog before it's late because I, I, I'm so stoked still that yesterday's vlog actually uploaded on time whilst I was in a rush. I'm so sorry it uploaded in 720p, but I just had to do it like that to get it up on time. So there you go. Continuing the daily vlog streak and uh, yeah, expect late vlogs whilst I'm here at E3 because I'll be drinking and going out late. And when I get back in the UK, I usually edit my vlog and get it done and uploaded. It doesn't have to be live till 6pm. But when I'm here in LA, I go out drinking, hanging out and stuff like that. And then need to edit the vlog when I get back to get it up for 10am in the morning. So it's kind of stressful with the time difference. But we'll see how things go. Much love to your faces. Make sure you follow me on Instagram whilst I'm here at this event. Just search the syndicate and we'll see how things go. Woo!